All right, guys. So this is what we call Edo. And as you can see, the Edo start sprouting already. So all these ready to plant. Some of them like this one, you see it have one eye here and it have one there. So what I'll do, I'll cut it and make it become two. Even with this one, you could cut it so now you have two. You even can cut them, you even can cut this in two, just like this. So you can get more. This, you can cut this in two, so you can get more out of them. So this is how you multiply your harvest. This is how you get more food. All right, so you cut this, so you have two. Now you cut this, and you have a next one. Watch. You see, look at eye is coming up right here. You could even cut this here as well. You see, you see, watch. So now we have three, watch. You have an eye shooting, so they're gonna be a head as well. This, you cut this in two. All this on a shoot out eyes. These are the eyes. And with Edo's, if you notice, there's another eye coming out here. There's another eye coming out here, and then it's gonna have even more. So this is how you know now. So I'm gonna cut it right between here because there's a other eye here. So I'm gonna cut it right between here because I know this eye gonna come and produce a plant by, by itself. So the same thing, I do the same thing with potato. So all these, so this we have one here. This is Edo, this is Edo. This is, okay, let me make it clear. Edo is something like, is something like elephant ears. But it's not elephant ears. Edo, you can eat Edo, but you cannot eat elephant ears. There's another one named Dasheen. Some people call it Tara. There's another one named Tanya. All of them almost look the same. The dashin is more bigger, but these are the edos. Let me see if I have a dashin. Okay, this is a dashin. I think they call this Tara. I think this in the um, Spanish eras they call this Tara. This they almost look the same, but it's not. This one is dashin. This one is edo. So now we have. Dashin, we have Edo, and we also have Tanya. So people call them different names. People call them different names, you know what I'm saying? But at least it's the same thing. Right, so now we have all these Edo plants. Look how much Edo plants we have. Because now we multiply them. In this bucket as well, we have potato, where we are also going and cut up as well. But today, I'm only going to plant the edos because it's getting a little late, so I'm going to be planting edos today. All this is real food, guys. I mean, I love to plant my vegetables, but I also love to plant food. Okay, so come with me. It's on. Okay, come with me. Okay, so as you can see, as you can see, I already dig out the trench go over here. You know what I'm saying? So now, let me show you how I plant the edos. One thing with edos, they don't need too much care. So this one, you're gonna put this up. And you cover it. You put this up and you just cover it.
There's a lot of food right here, guys. I'm telling you. A lot of food. Always make sure that this part is up. Because this is going to be the part that's going to be shooting up in the air. This is a lot of food here, guys. This ain't no joke. You guys need to do your research on Edo's. They use Edo's for a lot of different things. I know a lot of people used to use Edo's for baby. Like they're gonna, just like how you mash up the potato, it's the same way you could mash up the Edo's. You gotta give them a little space. The reason why you wanna give them a little space because you wanna, what happened is they grow up big and they bay from the bottom. So because they bay from the bottom, then you need room that the potato, that it can bear, just like potato. It's the same process, like potato. That's a lot, good bit of edo. I know plant there. Make sure you give them some room, the same way you're gonna give the potato the room. So what I did, I multiply the amount of edos I have. I almost do it. I almost have twice the amount. Very tasty in soup. You could cook it in soup. You could cook it and, and eat it just like if you have if you have um you could smash it up just like potato and do whatever you same how you do the potato all right so these are my old okra so what i'm gonna do now i'm going to dig up this pull these up that i can plant these rest edos Good energy. 